Hey guys, welcome to Cora Radar, your one-stop shop for tips and tricks in the digital world. Today we'll talk about what to do when your iPhone won't exit guided access. Apple's iPhone comes with a feature named guided access for many usages. It can be used to limit your device to a single app. It can be used to prevent certain areas of the screen from being tapped to avoid distraction. It can be also used to set up limitations on buttons, touch, keyboards, time limit and so on. It's good, until you find iPhone stuck in guided access. Why is the iPhone stuck in guided access? Maybe you press the wrong button so guided access won't turn off. Perhaps you forgot the guided access passcode and got stuck. Or, there is something wrong with the operating system like system bugs or software glitches, making the iPhone frozen in guided access. Now, follow me to try the troubleshooting ways to solve the problems. Don't worry if you're a novice of digital devices or a new iPhone user. We'll introduce all the methods step by step to make it easy to fix an iPhone stuck in guided access mode. Besides, if you have any questions, write it down in the comment below and we'll reply to you within 24 hours. Triple click the home or side button. Multiple users complain on Apple discussions forum that they don't mean to enable guided access. They triple press the home or side button and the option to turn on guided access appears. If this is your case, just press triple press the button again to turn off guided access on iPhone. In an iPhone 10 or later models, triple press the side button. In an iPhone 8 or previous models, triple press the home button. When prompted, enter the passcode you set up for guided access. Tap end and you should unlock iPhone stuck on guided access mode. Can't remember the passcode? Then, you can try using touch ID or face ID if you've set them up. Double click the side or home button. When prompted, put the finger on the sensor or glance at your iPhone. Then, tap end to exit guided access. Force restart your iPhone with buttons. If you find the screen doesn't respond to the button presses and fails to pop up the option to enter passcode and end a guided access session, there should be a problem with the software. To solve it, try attempting a forced restart. This won't lead to data loss. Here is how to exit guided access when it freezes on an iPhone by forcing it to restart. In an iPhone 8, iPhone 10, or later iPhone models, press and quickly release the volume up button. Press and quickly release the volume down button. Press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo. In an iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus, press and hold both the volume down button and side button. Continue holding both buttons until you see the Apple logo. In an iPhone 6s or older iPhone models, press and hold both the home button and the sleep or wake button. Continue holding both buttons until you see the Apple logo. You can try this method two or three times until you fix iPhone stuck in guided access. Enable lost mode to end iPhone guided access. Still unable to turn off guided access on iPhone? Try setting your device in lost mode. It's tried and tested that when your iPhone is in lost mode, it'll automatically end the guided access. All right now, follow these instructions to give it a try. On a tablet or computer, open a browser and go to iCloud.com. Sign in iCloud using the Apple ID and password you used to log in the iPhone that's stuck on guided access mode. Then, click the Find iPhone option and select your iPhone from the listed devices. Next, choose the Mark as Lost option. Grab your iPhone and it should get rid of guided access at the same time. Finally, just swipe your phone, enter the passcode to turn off lost mode and use the phone as usual again. Enter recovery mode to get rid of guided access. The last method you can try on your own when you get stuck on iPhone guided access is to try recovery mode. This feature enables you to use iTunes or Finder in a computer to fix iPhone software problems by doing an update or a restore. Pay attention to that doing a restore will wipe your data. So, make sure to follow the steps to do an update first, and then do a restore if the update fails to get rid of guided access on iPhone. Run iTunes or Finder on a Windows or Mac OS computer. Use a USB cable to connect your iPhone to the computer. Follow the on-screen instructions to enter recovery mode. For iPhone 8 and later models, press and quickly release the volume up button, then press and quickly release the volume down button. Finally, Press and hold the side button until the recovery mode screen appears. For iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, press and hold the volume down button and the side button simultaneously until the recovery mode screen appears. For iPhone 6s and earlier models, press and hold the home button and the side or top button simultaneously until the recovery mode screen appears. Once your iPhone is in recovery mode, iTunes or Finder will detect it and prompt you to update or restore your device. Now, when you see this dialog box in your computer, Choose the update option first. Click the update or restore option and wait for the process to complete. Maybe one hour, 
maybe three hours. When the process completes, see if it ends guided access on iPhone after booting it up. If not, repeat the steps above again. This time, choose the restore option from the dialog box in iTunes or Finder to fix frozen iPhone in guided access. And there you have it, folks. We've reached the end of our video on how to fix an iPhone stuck on guided access. Thank you for watching, and we wish you the best of luck in getting your iPhone back to working condition. If you did, please consider liking and subscribing to our channel Cora Radar for more tech-related content. Until next time.